Oh boy, the wait is almost over. More than 30 years after we first met the crew of the Starship Enterprise, Star Trek is back with a brand new series. Do you know me? What? Do you know me? No. Look at me. You're not sure. Star Trek Picard takes us back into that intergalactic world that we love but may not know so well anymore. Joining me now is Issa Briones, who stars in the new series. Oh, I'm so excited to talk to you. <laughs> it, okay, so, so we saw right there. It's, it, listen, it's called Picard, but this is, this is a story about your character as well. What was it like going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Sir Patrick Stewart? It was, um, I mean, my first day was was that scene that you really? just showed. So it was very nerve-wracking, obviously, <laughs> and this is very new to me. I, I, can't, I come from theater, so doing TV is very different. But, um, but I mean, Patrick is just so warm and welcoming that it just immediately felt like home with him. Okay, you've got to set this up for me as best you can, because okay. no spoilers, but <laughs> how would you tell our audience about what to expect in this show? Where are we? Um, well, so... 20 years has passed in, in the show, but the amazing thing is that 20 years has passed in our world as well. Mm -hmm. And um, as our world has changed, so has the show. Um, we're tackling issues that um, are Oops. are very relevant oh, no, no. to our life today. Oh, there, to, yeah, there are very real parallels. Yes, very, very much so. Um, and I think what I love about this show so much is it's so character driven. Um, you really, since it's a series, basically a 10-hour movie, you really get to delve into these characters and get to know them and care for them so much. Uh, listen, I remember when The Next Generation uh, came onto my television. You were not born yet. <laughs> I do not remember that. So, yeah. so how did you get, how did you familiarize yourself with not just the story and the characters, but what it means to people? I... I wish I had watched it as a, as a kid. I really did. I was kicking myself. Like, once I finally did get to watch it, I was like, why have I not been, <laughs> been aware of this enough? But, um, but maybe it gave you a chance to help create something new. It, it definitely, you definitely come at it from a new perspective. Um, but I, I went back and I watched Next Generation. I first started to kind of bop around to little episodes and, and like, uh, watch, uh, reading the descriptions, trying to see what pertained to my character. Mm -hmm. But... I got to like season three or four and I got hooked yeah. and I just started watching all the way through. That's amazing. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people uh, see the familiar face like Jean-Luc Picard and they want to know, are there any other familiar faces that, that we've loved for generations? Well, um, as, as we've we've announced that um, Jonathan Frakes is coming back. I was in an elevator with him in Los Angeles oh and I God. lost my mind. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's, he's the coolest guy. <laughs> he also directed two of our episodes yeah. and he's an amazing director as well as an actor um, and a wonderful uh, generous person to be around, and Marina Sirtis is back, um, and we saw Brent Spiner, and it's been a dream to work with them, truly. Now, we know that season two has already been greenlit. Yes. You must, <laughs> I mean, that's that, when you pour your heart and soul into a project to know that it's got the endorsement to come back for season two. Yeah. Are you, are you ready to tackle it already? I mean, I, I just, I, it really just shows how loyal the fans are. Um, the fact that they don't even know who we are. They have, they've never seen us. They don't know what we're going to do, but they've already met us with so much love and support. And that means the world to us. It feels like a family that we've joined. Yes, I, can, I can tell you, I watched the very first episode. I was blown away by your performance. I, you know, when I first saw the trailer, I was like, who is this girl? And I feel yeah. I, I'm already invested in your character. I cannot wait to see where you and the entire Trek family take this. This is going to be a spectacular ride. Thank you so much. Thanks so much. All right, and don't forget Star Trek Picard starts this Thursday, 9 p.m. on CTV Sci Fi, and then streams online on Crave. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.